Hi, uh, this is Chris Fournier here from the Innovation Hub. I'm here with Paul Campbell from Chess Engineering. And this is part of our series on interviewing members, both past, present, and maybe future, uh, here on our social media accounts. Uh, so Paul, uh, would you like to introduce yourself to the audience as well as just talk a little bit about Chess? Sure. My name is Paul Campbell. I'm the principal owner of Chess Engineering. Uh, we've been in Lowell since 2015 and we've been in business since 2013. And uh, I've been a member here since uh, 2020. Oh, wow, that's <laughs> impressive. Uh, so could you fill in the audience a little bit about what you guys do at Chess Engineering? Sure, so Chess, we're a land surveying and civil engineering uh, consultant. We specialize in land development, but we also do uh, infrastructure projects such as um, working at airports uh, and uh, transportation projects, but mainly land development. Wow, that's really cool. Yeah. Uh, so as as you're working and you said you're the principal owner, um, how many days a week would you say that you are here in the Innovation Hub in yep. space? Uh, so I'm here most of the week. Uh, we are equipped to work from home, but um, the work we do, uh, it makes more sense for us to be together. Mm -hmm. um, so we're here four or five days a week. And could you uh, talk, expand a little bit more about uh, how being here helps you guys just work together? Sure. Um, so it gives us uh, space to uh, collaborate together and then when we're working on plans and you need to uh, physically be looking at the same plan and maybe pointing at things, it's a little easier when you're in the same space versus trying to do something on Zoom or Teams. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, so in 2020, when you became a member, uh, what was it that really made you decide that the Innovation Hub was the best choice for you in chess? Sure. So uh, 2019, um, I quit my full-time job and made chess my full-time uh, position. So I was self-employed with no employees and I was looking for office space. So uh, a co-working space like this was the best solution for me because everything was taken care of and I didn't have to uh, outfit an office on top of everything else I was doing just to get the business up to a full-time uh, position. So so yeah, Innovation Hub was perfect for, for that. That's awesome, I'm very happy to hear that. Uh, so could you tell the audience what you believe the biggest advantages to being a member here at the Innovation Hub? Sure, so there's, there's a lot. Um, one, you're not having to spend your time managing an office. And two, uh, you guys are flexible in what size companies are here. So I started off by myself sitting at a dedicated desk, but if I just needed a laptop, I had you had space for that. And then once I started to add employees, it was very easy to get a, an, an office or more space. So and um, there was no long-term commitments to anything, so it was really flexible to grow as my company grew. That's awesome. Uh, and so speaking of your company growing, uh, you are leaving us actually by the end of the month, I believe the 24th. Yep. Uh, we are sad to see you go, even though that is uh, you know, awesome to see you continuing your success. Uh, so in lieu of that, what would you say your favorite memory of being here at the Innovation Hub would be? Sure, so I started here January 2020. Um, so two months later, things shut down and uh, we, I was locked out of the office when every, the whole world was shut down. So my favorite memory is when we were allowed back in. And so I was one of the first companies back in and those first couple of months, it was just myself, one other company with one person and Lisa who runs the place here, just the three of us every single day in an empty office. So um, I just remember those days and the mask and you know, just getting through it was was, was crazy. But I, I missed this place while I was gone. Mm -hmm. It was, you know, the whole point was to have a space to focus on work that wasn't home. And then two months later, I was back, <laughs> back home being forced to work. So definitely my favorite memory was when the, the office opened up back up. Well, awesome. Well, I thank you again for taking the time to speak with us here today. And I thank you at home for taking your time to watch this wherever this ends up being. Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, LinkedIn, you never know. But feel free to follow UMass Lowell Innovation Hub on all our social media platforms and we will see you soon.